Hey guys, what's up? Retro Mikey 78 here. Today we're here to tell you guys the end of round one has got there. The West bracket round one is over. Here's the results. So, sit back, enjoy. Before you do, leave a like, subscribe, follow me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and follow me on Instagram. And hit that bell, share this so that you guys can get more votes for your games and get them up there. I'm going to explain to you at the end of the video why it's important to help your game get more votes. Alright, this round was a blowout round. The closest game contest was 6 points. Wow, 6 points was the closest one. So, here we go. We're going to recap this round and this round was a major blowout. Zelda, Link to the Past. Great game. Made it to the Final Four this year. Was invited back this year. Had number one seed. Went up against Parasite Eve. Could Parasite Eve infect Zelda? No, it couldn't. Zelda won 24-4 to and it's gone. Next up, we had Metal Gear Solid versus Wario World. Metal Gear Solid, an awesome, awesome franchise. Love the first one when it first came out on the PlayStation. Wario World, awesome, awesome game too. Um, but could it collect enough coin to pay its way and destroy Metal Gear Solid? No, folks. Metal Gear Solid won 21 to 7. Next up, we had the Battle Royale franchise that most people love. Fortnite versus the classic that started it all, Wolfenstein 3D. Could Fortnite use its tremendous power and how much people love it, I guess, these days. Overcome one of the first first-person shooter games ever made. Did it? Uh, Fortnite had six, while Wolfenstein had 22. Like I told you guys, folks, this whole contest, this whole round, was a blowout. Next up, we had State of Decay 2. Not a bad zombie game. I played a little bit of it on Xbox Game Pass. Versus God of War, that awesome franchise on the PlayStation. State of Decay, the zombies got you guys infected and got you guys to vote seven times for it. But the gods, the gods of war, got you guys to give them 21 votes to cherish them. And destroyed that zombie-filled area. Next up, we had Earthbound versus Pranzer Dragon series. Earthbound, a great game on the SNES from what I hear. I still haven't played it. I need to. In the Panzer Dragon series, I don't have any of them, so I haven't played those. This was kind of a blind round for me. But you guys told me what you guys thought, and I did help you guys and vote for what I thought it was, was probably best. Earthbound got 22 votes. Panzer Dragon got four. So 22 to 4. That means Panzer Dragon is out. Couldn't fly its way around Earthbound. Next up we had Frogger versus Gears of War. Frogger hopped its way through the streets. Tried to get over the river and got itself 11 votes. But Gears of War shot its way and shot Frogger right. It was hopping off that log and got 17 votes to win this contest folks. Years of War is going on to round two. Next up, Sunset Overdrive. Not a bad game. I, I've got it on the Xbox One. It, it's all right. But it got its way up to nine votes. And it got up there. But it was going up against Stubbs. Stubbs the Zombie. A classic game on the original Xbox. A lot of people love it. Stubbs went in there and got you guys all riled up and infected enough people to vote 17 times for it. And made it move to round two this year. Unlike last year where it got stuck in round one. So 17 to 9 Stubbs beat Sunset Overdrive. Next up we had Mario 64 versus Left 4 Dead. Did Mario 64 out jump and out hit those zombies and the tanks and the witches in Left 4 Dead? Awesome franchises folks. I play Mario 64 a lot and I play Left 4 Dead a lot with my wife. So, what happened? What happened? Those zombies could not infect Mario. Mario jumped and punched his way to another victory. So, 
Like I said, folks, the closest one was Frogger versus Gears of War as a six point deficit. Everything else in this round was a blowout. I don't think round two is going to be a blowout. I think round two is going to be close because these are a lot of games that people love. So here we go. We're going to recap. This will be going live Saturday. Remember, this is just results. No voting yet. But Saturday morning, this will be going live. Here we go. Zelda Link to the Past will be going up against Metal Gear Solid. Can Snollis Snake sneak his way through the cameras and the minefields and get his way up there and grab Link and snap his neck so he can't save Zelda? Or will Link stab his sword and use his shield to protect himself to defeat Solid Snake? You guys will have to vote for that one on Saturday. Next up, we have... Wolfenstein 3D, the, one of the first first-person shooter games ever made in a great franchise versus another great franchise on the PlayStation, God of War. What's going to happen there? Are the gods going to rise up and destroy the Wolfenstein franchise or is the Wolfenstein franchise going to turn from killing Nazis and go over and kill those gods? Only you guys be able to tell. Next up, we have another great game on the SNES. Earthbound going up against a franchise on Xbox, Gears of War. Can Gears of War shoot those little kids that are trying to save the world? Or can the little kids take a break from saving the world and kill those soldiers? I don't know. You guys will have to vote for it. And the last one in this contest, Mario 64 will be going up against Stubbs the Zombie. It has to face another zombie game. This one had a lot more power in the last round. So, you guys are going to vote for Stubbs the Zombie, a classic one that's sought after. A lot of people are looking for it. Or you don't vote for the Nintendo 64 launch title that a lot of people love and cherish. Remember, Saturday morning, this will be going live. Right now, folks, North Bracket's going live right now till 7.30 tomorrow morning from when I drop this video. The South Bracket will, Round 2 will be going live tomorrow morning at 7.30. All this is Central Standard Time. This is Friday morning and this is Saturday morning for Round 2. So, hurry up, get over here, vote for your games. So, this will be the first round of the Sweet 16. So, you got four games going in there for the Sweet 16. Then you got four down here. So, you guys, get it up, get your votes. Remember... It's important to share this, talk about this, get people to help you because you need to get your game that you like in this category, in whichever one of these brackets to this final four. Because if you get your game to the final four, like I told you, I'm going to tell you why it's important to get votes for your game. You get your game to the final four, next year your game will automatically be brought back for season three and we'll get... A number one seed. Mike Tyson's Punch Out, Mega Man 2, Zelda Link to the Past, and Final Fantasy 7 got those number one seeds this year, were automatically invited back from last year. But Final Fantasy 7 and Mega Man 2 have already been eliminated. So give votes, share this around, talk to about people because you guys get your favorite game up here this Final Four and next year. It can be in this tournament again. Hey, we got the $25 digital code giveaway going on now till March 20th. Don't forget to enter. We also have Retro April, Retro Mikey merchandise available, T Public. Both those links will be down below. Thanks for watching. Remember what I'm telling you guys because, you know, the more people that vote, the more votes you get, the more chances you get to the go, go into the final four and make it back next year. Thanks for watching Retro Mikey 78 and we'll be here tomorrow morning.